Yellowstone District School Board is situated on the traditional territories of the Haudenosaunee and Anishinaabe. We acknowledge their enduring presence on this land, as well as the presence of Métis, Inuit, and other First Nations from across Turtle Island. We honor their cultures and celebrate their commitment to this land. Hello, and congratulations to our graduates, and of course, their families and teachers. We know that the success you are celebrating today is the result of many years of hard work and determination, coupled with the support of the many people who care about you. Before we begin, I would like to thank the staff members who worked hard to acknowledge and celebrate this very special graduation, and to our very caring community, who through their generosity and support, provide so much assistance to our graduates. As we all know, Change is a necessary part of life, and for you, our graduates and your families, you might just be facing the greatest change you have ever experienced as you head off in search of whatever great adventure awaits you. This year, more than ever, our world and the challenges we continue to face have prepared you for that change. More than ever, you have had to practice self-discipline, remain optimistic, take action, and model respect. In short, Eagles, more than any other year, you have had to soar and you have emerged prepared, successful, and stronger than ever. We must acknowledge that this, your final year of secondary school, was not what any of us wanted or could have ever anticipated. Let's remember, however, that we did not get to this point in one year. This has been the culmination of your many years at Ernestown Secondary School, and I ask you to keep the memories of all of those years in your minds and hearts today. Congratulations, Class of 2020, and thank you for everything you've brought to Ernestown in so many ways. This celebration is about you and for you. Please know how much we admire you and wish you the very best as you embrace this wonderful and very exciting change and begin your next great adventure. Graduation is a milestone. While it marks the culmination of your secondary school studies, it is so much more than a diploma. It is a symbolic milestone of moving from childhood to adulthood. The pandemic has our world in crisis, but you, our students, will come out stronger. It is our graduates, our young people, who have demonstrated your resilience and responsibility to lead the way. I know that you will be change makers who will help us move forward in a positive and constructive way, leading to great things. This may not be how you expected to end your high school career, but we hope it will still be memorable. I am incredibly proud of you graduates. Today, we celebrate your personal successes, your significant commitment to your education, your desire to achieve, your hope for a bright future. Graduates, your schools, your families, and I have endless hope for you. Congratulations to the graduating class of 2020.
To begin, I am not entirely upset this speech is a video because now I do not have to picture any of you in your underwear. I would like to say thank you to each and every one of the Ernest Town staff members and faculty members for the hard work and dedication you have shown us students throughout our four years at the school. I would like to thank parents and family members for the love, the compassion, and the discipline you provided for us during our time spent in high school. I know throughout our lives, as we thought about our glorious graduation, we did not envision the day quite like this. Although these circumstances are not what we wish for, and they are keeping us from being together today, there is still plenty to celebrate. My friends, we made it. Congratulations to the Ernestown Secondary School Class of 2020 for graduating. I invite you all to forget the undesirable situation and to look on the brighter side of things. We are all able to spend invaluable time with our loved ones and family members during this period, which is something that we will all be thankful for in the future. We have all now mastered the elegant art of washing our hands, and now we finally have an excuse for not sharing a bite of our lunch. Of course, we must also celebrate all of our hard work and accomplishments on this day. What a crazy four years it's been. Think about all that we've been through, all of the nights spent studying, the tests, the summatives, the nerve-wracking exam seasons. Every time you lost a pen, where did they all go? Reminisce on the amazing times we had. The school events, the sports games, the times so Scott hit in the face with a pie. The bonds and relationships you've created, the memories we've made throughout high school that we will miss and cherish forever. We came into high school a group of naive and curious children and have grown into responsible and strong-willed young adults who will now take our next steps in life. I know each of us will flourish in our pathways because we have all grown tremendously and have overcome many obstacles over the last four years, which has readied us for our upcoming adventures. As we go our separate ways, I would like to share one other message with you all to remember. Today, we face many obstacles in society. May it be climate change, the pandemic at hand, social injustice, or inequality. Gandhi once said, be the change that you wish to see in the world. I hope that as we become older and our voices become stronger, that we use our power as part of the population to help change the world for the better. Remember that all leaders, all of those who have changed the world started off as high school students just like us. We are the leaders of tomorrow. And I hope that we all take the time to stand up for what we believe in and for what is right. Together, we can help innovate and evolve our world. Enjoy the day, enjoy time with family and loved ones, and always remember our great times together. It is time for us to spread our wings and soar like the eagles we are. Thank you.